Hi guys, my name is Amir Shahzad. I'm working on the YouTube and this is my video on the requested video from Mr. Eric. Uh, Eric asked me about the how we make a code uh, in the total station. He are using the Leica TS06 Plus. Actually, I already done this one before, uh, maybe eight months before in my TS06 Plus. But that video was in the Urdu language. So I make new codes in TS09 in the what is requirement. So for the code, we have uh, some uh, methods. So I will go to the with the simple method. For example, this is our main display after the uh, power on the instrument. So I will go to the program. There is a survey. And that one, I will make a new job for the new coding. I press F1 and I will put the name. I put the name only test file. Okay, and then the operator, I will put my name only operator. And there are more remarks and detail. I don't go to be a make this one. I will just F4 and then continue. And now I have a new job. So uh, this is uh, I'm not doing only in the office for the code. So I don't need to be a set station. Just press F4 or hit the with a touch screen. I will continue for the survey. Okay, for that one, uh, I will do some make a code and also use this one because this data I'm using in the civil 3D as a reference how we can use this code in the civil 3D. Okay, for that one, uh, I will do, uh, I will make some code and also store this data. For that one, I go to the EDM and I change to my prism as a non prism and then F3 continue. And there is a sign for the non prism. If there is a circle, that is a round, uh, round uh, prism. So now I will go to the code F2 and then I will make a new code. This one before I was using in my last job. Once we save the code, this code will continue in the instrument until we are not delete any job. So I will make a new. For example, uh, he said to me, uh, his requirement is uh, like code is a tree. So for the tree, I will write here TR. Then OK. And then if you need the some Q code, I don't do this one. So I will make OK. And then the description. What is the uh, tree? So for the TR, I will use for the tree. And then I will write description tree. And then okay there is a more information uh, like info what is this kind of tree what is the diameter like that so so many there is an option we will info all we will put there is a uh, eight di uh, difference of the info we can put it that one so for tree I will just use a code as a TR and the description is tree so I will put F4 for the continue okay i will make a new more code he said me a some make a code so like uh, i make a new what the, like uh, catch basin for the catch basin i will use cb okay uh, i will use another because catch basin was is there so i will use like uh, sentry manhole sentry sewage manhole so i will use ss okay then the, I will put the description uh, this one sentry S A N I T A R Y sentry and then space sentry manhole. Sorry. If you need more detail like info, I will put this is the diameter is uh, one meter. I write just only one mm and sorry. 
and then OK. And then some more detail, we can say this is a concrete manhole. So like uh, we put the concrete. And then if you need more detail, you can continue what else. So if you have enough detail, you can uh, put F4 continue. Actually, this info is also, uh, we can use as a attribute. And I will make one more code like uh, benchmark. Okay. I make a new code uh, from here. From pressing F2 or only touch the screen and make a new code. I will uh, make a benchmark code is BM. Okay. And then description for the BM is a benchmark. BE. So here I put the description benchmark for the BM and then press OK. If you need some more detail, you can put it more detail like uh, steel pin or concrete. I will put the only the pin. And then OK. If you need put more detail, uh, you can put it more detail. But for me is no problem. I can press continue. So if I need to be use this one, uh, uh, this uh, uh, code, so what I will do, this is my survey page, I will press F4, F4 again, and then I'll come to the main place. Okay, now uh, only for the roughly how I use this one, I will put uh, my here, this one only, and there is my code is BM, so point number PT ID, one, there is a height of reflector, code, horizontal angle, vertical, and, and so on. There is a easting, northing. So I will use same. So I will press F1 for the measure. So there is, I put one point. The point number first, serial number one is the BM. So when I have a change, I will just click here. I will use another. For example, I use TR. So I will move my instrument little bit. And I set any some uh, points for the reference because this code I will use in the civil 3D. So same, I want press F1 or measure. So this is my tree. If you want to more code, you can just replace with SS. This is sentry manual. So I will take one more point for other direction. I just uh, rotate my instrument and what else we have a points and just put the F1 for the measure. So for this job I will keep it only three points and now I have a three points. So this test file I make a three point in my instrument I save one is the benchmark second is the tree and third is the sentry manhole so this is the method how we can use uh, code first I make the code and then I use in the survey actually the request for the mr. Eric was only about the code because he said I did not success in the coding so this is the way how you make code so next video I will uh, show in the Civil 3D how we use these codes in the various situations. For this is only test file.
in the detail i will make a more videos but this is only for the, on the request of mr eric so for this one enough so take care and please if you like my video please share is that one so and don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks